Good morning, Skyline. I'm a cookie, and I'm Coraline. And your Skyline scoop starts right now. now. Happy Halloween, everyone. It's finally here, and you know we had to dress up. I'm Coraline, and you're not listening to me. That's because you're crazy. And I kept it simple and cute by being a cookie. So cute, I could just eat you up like a Snickers. <sighs> Speaking of which, programs are being delivered today. And we really hope you got one. Also, Hosa is still selling boot tumblers until November 6th. You can pre-order using the QR code or stop by their table outside of the cafeteria. And if you didn't get anything gifted this Halloween, you could go to the store after November 1st and buy yourself multiple bags of candy for, you know, around the same price as a reward for not for existing. Yep, because that's the best time to get some. But you don't deserve a reward if you've missed five or more days because you have lost credit for this semester. But wait up, here's what you can do. To fix it, you have to complete academic seat time during principal plan or your teacher's tutoring hours. Mm-hmm. And principal plan sessions will begin next week on Mondays and Wednesdays from 4.30 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. in the senior cafeteria. But you must bring your own electronic device, pencils, pens, paper, and supplies because it will not be provided. Please scan the QR code posted in your teacher's classroom or the, right, the one right here up on screen. Now, to our weatherman, Chris. Thank you, Anchor Pals. I'm Chris, and I'm filling in for America as she's somewhere in America. It is Thursday, my spooky friends, and today's weather is a cloudy high of 77 degrees with a chill low of 58 degrees. It's getting a little windy here, too. But we're not about that just yet, as tomorrow's weather will be a high 77 degrees with a low of 67 degrees, a 29% chance of rain, and 81% humidity. Whether you like it or not, I'll be here just today. Back to the Anchor Pals. Thanks, Chris. Now, if you ever thought about being a model, the Skyline Fashion Marketing and Fashion Design Clusters are hosting a model call for their spring fashion show to get you going in the right direction. This model call is for female and male models on November 12th at 445 in room F10. Anyone interested in being a model is welcome to sign up and there will be further information for students interested at the event. And are you a big fan of all things Halloween and like Tim Burton like I do? Then join us during all lunches outside of the cafeteria for some spooky fun. Come create a Tim Burton selfie and you don't need drawing experience to do this. This activity is sponsored by the B12 committee and the graphic design magnet students. And since I'm dressed up as Coraline, no, y'all see the wig. This is the perfect opportunity to say, Coraline is not created by Tim Burton. Just feel like I had to say that. <sighs> there she goes. Anyways, now for the main event in my favorite part of the show, where we're going to talk about that one hit show of the group of people who did that one thing and ended up in that one place to do that other thing, it's Gabriel. <laughs> Good morning, Raiders. My name is Gabriel Marion, and welcome to Understand Pop Culture, where I'll be showing you the most influential movies, music, and media released on this day in history. And today is Halloween. It's one of my favorite holidays, along with Christmas, Thanksgiving, and anything else that gets me a day off of school. Hopefully, we have something really great for today. Let's see. On this day, October 31st in 2010, The Walking Dead premiered in the United States. Really? That's it? Don't get me wrong, it's a great show and all, and it's very influential, but, I mean, it's Halloween. There's no iconic horror movies, no mass killers or anything, really? Okay, I guess we have zombies for today. The show follows Rick Grimes, a cop, as he leads a group through an apocalyptic world full of zombies. Or should I say walkers? They never call them zombies in it. The show was based off of the popular graphic novel series with the same name, which actually had a crossover with Invincible, of all things. Just thought that was a fun fact. The series had 11 seasons and 6 spin-off shows, some of which are still airing, along with a lot of video games and comics. It made zombies really popular for a few years and they started appearing in everything. It also made a bunch of people traumatized about baseball bats. If you know, you know. 
Well, that's it for today. Hopefully you can tune in tomorrow to see what happened on that day in pop culture. Thanks, Gabriel. Now, maybe you're looking for a job. Well, Chick-fil-A is looking for you. Yep. Chick-fil-A at the Town East Mall location is seeking responsible, reliable, and enthusiastic employees. You, you can scan the QR code or text the number to apply. Don't miss out on the opportunity to make some money for the upcoming holidays. Mm -hmm. And if you need assistance with filling out applications, interviewing skills, or resume writing, you can always see Ms. Ballard in room B54. She'll be offering job readiness prep sessions on Wednesdays from 4.30 to 5.30 p.m. Well, that's it for this Halloween. See you later, ghouls. Catch you later, goblins. <laughs> Here's Skyline Scoop. Ends right now. No. no.